Niger Munchetti clashed with Nicola Sturgeon on BBC Breakfast as the host asked Scotland's First Minister how she planned to transition from fossil fuel dependency to renewable energy sources. However, Munchetti hit back when Sturgeon implied the BBC presenter hadn't been listening to her answers. Sturgeon explained, We can't turn off oil and gas overnight for a variety of reasons, energy security but also particularly in the Scottish context, although we're not unique here, the economic and jobs impact. We've got to do that in a planned way and with justice and fairness at his heart. I grew up in the 80s during deindustrialization when the Tory government then failed to plan for it and left communities and individuals on the scrap heap and the legacy of that is still with us. We mustn't repeat those mistakes but, and this is a big but because it's what we owe also to the next generation, we've got to accelerate that move away from fossil fuels as much as we can because the future of the planet depends on it. Interjecting, Munchetti said, you have said that. Well it's important, Sturgeon replied as Munchetti hit back, I know and I've heard you say it. I'm interested because you are in Aberdeen now and Aberdeen obviously is reliant and sources of jobs are reliant on, the fossil fuels, industry. What would you say to them? I think the oil and gas sector supports around 100,000 jobs in Scotland and responsible for 5% of Scotland's GDP. What do you say about their jobs? transitioning, when does that happen to them? Scotland's First Minister replied, if you've been listening to me I was directly addressing those points. I pointed out to you the economic impact and the number of jobs that are dependent on oil and gas. You did, Munchetti hit back. And my question was, what happens to those, jobs? We transition them into the massive potential we currently have on renewable energy, the First Minister answered. BBC Breakfast viewers took to Twitter to hit out at Munchetti accusing Sturgeon of getting it easy. At JDH2820470 tweeted, Hashtag breakfast pathetic interview with Sturgeon. Just letting her ramble on. Just ask the question does she support new drilling? At your mama 500 added, At TV Naga 01 hashtag breakfast come on Naga you normally talk all over politicians. Sturgeon's getting it easy. At breakfast punchy Naga giving Sturgeon a free ride. Hardly said a word and setting up questions to give her free run. Oddly not interrupting. Shocking, at small 1365 wrote. However, at Ray underscore I'll disagreed, at breakfast does Naga Munchetti have to make it so obvious that she dislikes Nicola Sturgeon? At Foxhaven Garden noted, why is Naga on at breakfast giving Nicola Sturgeon a difficult time and constantly interrupting her and I can audibly hear Naga sighing loudly. Not a good look Naga.